Let's do our final topic, Hart. I asked you to bring three wishes. You have three wishes for college basketball season. A genie pops out and says, here, Cart, I'll make any three things you want this college basketball season come true. You could use these in a lot of ways. You're an angry, spiteful person sometimes. You're a loving, generous person sometimes. How do you want to use your three wishes for college basketball season this year? Uh, for, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to knock on the genie lamp. I'm not going to rub a lamp. That's I always thought rubbing the lamp's a little weird to get a genie out. Just knock and ask for him to come out. He's the already first out. thing I would do. <laughs> He's already out. You don't need to knock. He's out. He, he oh, appeared oh. to you. Yeah. Okay, bet. Um, I'll be simple with this. I want Xavier Booker to play 25 minutes a game. No matter what, like that's, that's a wish I want. I think that'll lead for good success for my team. I want a final four with only top 25 teams. T- top 25. No, sorry. Actually take that. I want a final four with only top 10 Ken Palm teams or Evan Miyakawa teams, only top 10 teams. Don't want a situation where you get the plunky Cinderella underdog. I think after last year's Final Four, we deserve something something special, something epic. And I don't think last year's was. And lastly, I want Purdue to make a Final Four. I'm going back to my Purdue take. <laughs> what? Dude, what? I want him to lose. I don't want him to win it. I want him to make it and not win it all. This has swung so far for me. I never know what to expect from you. You have three wishes. You can make anything happen. You could wish for Michigan State to win a national championship. And instead, you're wishing for Purdue to make a Final Four. Make a Final Four and lose. But you didn't wish. Like they, they, don't make, they, they don't make it to the ship. You didn't wish for Michigan State to win at all. Because they will. I don't need to wish for that. You're... My backcourt got me. Oh my God. I can't. So you are prioritizing Purdue making a final four over Tom Izzo getting his second. That's how you're mentally approaching. No, well, Tom Tom Izzo will get his second, but I don't want to argue anymore about good coach, bad coach, Matt Painter and them not getting to a final four. And if they get to one, I can literally wipe that slate clean and I can move on to something else productive in my life. Okay. I like that stance, but I just, I can't believe you when given the chance to make anything happen in college basketball, you picked Michigan state's rival in the big 10 to make a final four. Yeah. I also said, I did not want to speak about Purdue in this. And I somehow moved to my third wish being for them to make a final four. I mean, this is just stuff you can only get from me folks. Entertainment peak, honestly, like you're just one of one after, after saying you wouldn't go to Purdue to end with that for your final moment on the show today. is just incredible stuff. Um, all right. I, I think you already know my three, not to spoil it, but I said this in a group chat, so I'm I'm just going to go with the same three. And yes, these are spiteful, petty things. Sorry. Someone's going to be in the comments like, Greg sounds like a bitter ex. No shit. I am a bitter ex. Okay. <laughs> Here's what's going on. Uh, my first wish is that with two weeks left in the season, like March 7th or so, like a week before conference tournament play starts, uh, Hunter Dickinson, leaves the Kansas basketball team. There's front page rumors. Where's Hunter? What's he doing? Bill Self has to release a statement that Hunter is no longer with the team. Two days later, Hunter Dickinson joins TNT's postseason coverage of college basketball. Meanwhile, by the way, mind you, haven't said this, Kansas is 17 and 14 at this point. It is clear that Kansas is going to miss the NCAA tournament, which is why Hunter has shut it down. Hunter is now in studio. He shows up his first day of work for the NCAA tournament, like hits in studio for the whole day marathon stream, whatever. He shows up in handcuffs. Everyone's like, Hunter, why are you in handcuffs? He says, he looks like deadpan Jim Halpert style, looks at the camera and says, well, because Bill Self had me in handcuffs all year long. And scene. That's my dream. If I could have one thing happen, it would be that. It would be so gratifying. Uh, my second wish is that I want to be generous. I want to be generous to you. I think you've waited long enough. You know, three consecutive years of 13 loss basketball is tough on anyone. I mean, it's, that's some rucker shit. So for you to have made it through that uh, is incredible. You've been patient, and uh, I want to reward that. So my, my second wish is that Michigan State finishes the regular season and conference tournament undefeated. Two banners, regular season champs, Big Ten tournament champs, you're sitting there at 30 and 0 heading into the NCAA tournament, the number one overall seed. That is my second wish. I hope it happens for you. I'll be rooting so hard that that happens for you and Tom Izzo. 
My third wish is that you get upset by a 16 seed in the first round. Okay. I, I was waiting for that. I knew that was okay. All right. Wow, that I mean that was that was petty and spiteful, Greg, to a T. That I mean, you were in your vintage bag there. I miss that guy. Actually, I, I don't miss him. I see him every day. I want it to happen so bad. I want all of those things to happen so bad. 